This morning, we're spending some time with members of the 1157th Transportation Company. Emily Dean joins us live from EAA with more. Good morning, Emily. Good morning, Angie Doug. Hi, everybody. This morning, we are inside the Eagle Hangar out here at EAA in Oshkosh, where they will have a special send-off ceremony today for members of the 1157th Transportation Company. Right now, I'm here with Sergeant Susan Delaney, who is with them. Good morning to you. Good morning. So tell me how long you've been with the 1157. Um, just about six years now. And we just learned, actually, we said before that they were actually uh, being deployed to Kuwait. They are not. They are being deployed to Afghanistan now. So, Susan, tell me how um, that has changed your mindset, being deployed to Afghanistan now versus Kuwait. Well, it's a little bit different, but uh, we're going with a really great group of people, so we're really excited about it. So tell me what you will be doing overseas. We're going to be doing haul missions. And what does that mean? Um, basically just going from one place to the other, picking things up and taking them to another place. <laughs> okay. So tell me a little bit about yourself. You are married, mm -hmm. no children, you're from Kakana. Um, tell me how that's going to be leaving your husband behind. Well, it's going to be hard, I think, um, but we have a really strong family and um, our faith will definitely help us get through it. So being with the 1157 for six years now, what have you experienced over those years? Um, a lot of uh, really great people. Um, everybody is, is really good at what they do, and we're all just really close, so it's going to be great. Yeah, 130 members are actually going to be uh, deployed. Tell me your relationship with those other soldiers. Well, um, I don't know everybody very well, but we're all broken down into our own platoons and our own groups. So we've been, uh, we've been training together a lot, and I think it's going to be a lot of fun. So the ceremony is actually going to be taking place this morning here inside the Eagle Hangar. Um, it's open to the public. So what do you want people, if they are watching at home, what would you say to them to have them come out? Why would you tell them to come to the ceremony today? Uh, I always think that it's a really uh, good idea just to support your community, and that's what we are. We're all a big community and big family, so the more support, the better. Well, Sergeant Susan Delaney, we're so thankful you were on the show with us today. Thank you so much for what you do, too, for our country. And you guys, you can come check it out at EAA 11 this morning, open to the public. We have all the information at fox11online.com. Click on Good Day Wisconsin. We'll send it back to you. Emily, I have a question. How long ago did they know that it was changing from Kuwait to Afghanistan? Now, Sergeant Susan Delaney, we were talking about this a little bit before. Angela just asked me the question, how long did you know that it was going to be switched over to Afghanistan instead of Kuwait? Did you know we were talking about it probably a week you knew? Yeah, about a week. But why couldn't you tell people? Um, just for security reasons. Yep. And then last night was pretty much when you learned that you were going to Afghanistan? No, we found that out about a week ago. A week ago, and then announced it last night. Correct. Okay. So, yeah, they found out a week ago and then couldn't really say anything, and then last night was when they yeah. announced that they were going to Afghanistan instead of Kuwait. So, yeah. understand that, you know, for security reasons. Yeah. All right, Emily, thanks so much. We'll, we'll check back in with you later.